In this module, we'll look at the background to the blockchain, its relation to Bitcoin, how it compares to the internet of 1995, and where venture capitalists are investing. Personally, I got involved in the internet on February 12, 1995, at 2.16pm in the afternoon. That's how much of an effect it had on me, and I said to myself at that time, I have to be in this business. So at the time, we set up an internet cafe by a restaurant and a web design house. Where the blockchain technology is right now is where the internet was back in 1995. It's raw, but has phenomenal potential. With the internet, email was the first wave. That was its first real use case, with TCP IP, the underlying technology. 20 years on from that first use case, we can see how things have changed, how many new brands have been created, and how many billion dollar businesses have been established. The blockchain is in exactly the same position as the internet was back in 1995. Where email was the first wave of the internet, Bitcoin was the first wave of the blockchain, when it was first launched in 2009. Blockchain is like the TCP IP of the internet, it is the underlying technology behind Bitcoin. So as a result, Bitcoin was the first wave and blockchain is the future. If we look at where the investment is actually going into this space, you can probably appreciate how positively the venture capital communities are viewing it. This infographic from Virtual Capital Ventures highlights the investments that have been made into financial services. This second infographic shows the investment into core technical infrastructures. Equally, there are so many non-financial investments that are also beginning to be made, thus reinforcing the Goldman Sachs statement. In a nutshell, we shall see in this course the blockchain is the Internet of Value and the Internet of Ownership. So let's look at what exactly blockchain is all about.